Alrighty, so this is RPI Locator by Andre Costa. It's a website that provides stock availability for Raspberry Pi products. On the home page, you can sort by vendor or device. I'll show you more of that in a second, but real quick, I wanna jump over to the about page. On the about page, you can learn about Costa and what he does. In the second paragraph, he writes, this database was created out of frustration trying to locate a Raspberry Pi product in the height of the chip and supply chain shortages of 2021. I got tired of visiting multiple websites every day trying to figure out if there were any Raspberry Pis in stock. I coded this website in a few days during my spare time and had it hosted on a Raspberry Pi for a couple of weeks before deciding to make it publicly available. This is not hosted on a Raspberry Pi anymore. <laughs> so, uh, Costa, we definitely share your frustration. He then goes on to say, although they are hard to find, Raspberry Pi computers do come back in stock every so often. Keep your eyes peeled and visit the main page often. The last few Raspberry Pis I purchased was using this tool. If you find this website useful, share it with someone that might also find it useful. There is no share button, so you have to go old school and copy and paste the link. So yeah, salute to you, Andre Costa, for building this website because it is going to be very helpful going forward. You can see he has his contact info, his GitHub, uh, link to his Instagram, and some of his other shops. So go check out his stuff. Can I get notified when a product becomes available? I might add this feature if enough people request it. So hit them up. <laughs> Keep in mind that many vendors already let you sign up for notifications directly on their website. I recommend doing this anyway because some vendors have limitations on how many items you can purchase. So you may be in a situation where you need to order a pie or two from one vendor, et cetera, et cetera. Do you get commission? This website does not get any commissions or kickback from any of the vendors featured here. None of the links that take you to the vendor or product web pages are tracking links. This website does not use cookies either. And he also talks about why every vendor is not listed. I'll let you guys uh, read that for yourself, but let's jump back over to the home page. So when you land on the home page, every item that is in stock will be listed at the top and highlighted in green. As you can see, not much is available. C Studio still has some CM4s in stock. Scrolling down, you can see that most of these SKUs are of the CM4 models. Not every single one is listed here, but quite a few are listed based on uh, whatever uh, website that the uh, robots have scrubbed. As you get to the bottom, you can see the listings for Raspberry Pi 4, the different vendors, and at the very bottom, there's listings for Raspberry Pi 02Ws. Now, if you go back to the top, you see you have drop downs for vendors and devices. So you can slightly refine your search based on what it is you're looking for. So, for example, if you click on the vendors drop down, you see we have listings for Adafruit, SparkFun, Pie Shop, Newark, etc. If you go up and you click all, it'll give you every single listing regardless of vendor. If you do the same for devices, let's just say we do Pi 4, it'll give you all the Pi 4 listings for every store, when it was last updated, etc. So I'm just gonna go back to the home page and uh, I'll show you how the filter search works. Essentially, if you know the SKU for whatever product you're looking for, you can just start typing. So I'm gonna do CM4 and I want a model with Wi-Fi, so I'm gonna click one, then zero, then if I want a four gig model, I'm gonna type four, and I'll stop typing, and as you can see, it generates the list of CM4 models that were scrubbed on the various vendor websites. So yeah, that is RPI Locator. If you find this website helpful, be sure to share it. If you wanna give the creator some feedback, his contact information is on the about page. Give him a shout out. Again, he doesn't make any commission off this. It's for everyone to use. And I do encourage you, if you are shopping for any of these products to set up email alerts so that when they are available, you can just go and buy. But uh, it'll be cool to just stop by this guy's social or GitHub or wherever and just tell him thanks for building this because this is 
an awesome web page in these supply shortage times. So I'm Jason. This has been our pie locator. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.